Welcome to this brief introductory video on how to make short educational and instructional videos for research education. wanted to first off start off by um, describing a few basic ingredients that I'm using to make these videos. Uh, the first of which is a Wacom bamboo pen tablet. There are several different tablets available. Uh, I purchased this one for approximately $70 online. Uh, I'm using Camtasia for Mac software uh, to record this video. There's also a PC version of Camtasia available uh, online. Presently I'm using the 30-day free trial version and I plan to eventually upgrade to the paid version. Um, in order to record my voiceover I'm using a Logitech external microphone. This was one that I actually had um, Prior to purchasing uh, the tablet, I feel that an external microphone gives you a little bit of higher audio quality compared with the internal microphone that's included in the iMac uh, computer. Um, in order to set up my black uh, chalkboard, or blackboard I should say, I'm using Corel uh, Painter Essentials. version 4. This was a free software application that was included with the Bamboo Pen tablet um, and it's very easy to use. I set the dimensions of the blackboard to be a little bit larger uh, than the recording area so it gives me um, the widest possible screen uh, to uh, make my instructional video. Uh, what I'm going to do now is select all of my text and to clear the blackboard and now just spend a few moments uh, going over some of the essentials uh, for making effective videos. The first uh, is to choose a background color um, which is both visually appealing and also uh, easy for the viewer uh, to watch for an extended period of time. Um, many of us have found that a black background uh, is very easy uh, with a light colored uh, ink. Uh, which this what this does is really maximizes the color contrast and keeps it visually appealing and what I'll do is just make a few notes here um, black or we'll just say dark background with a light colored ink and uh, just for illustrative purposes we'll choose a different color um, light colored ink And one of the other critical components of making these videos is to keep them short and to keep them to the point. In our experience, keeping these videos at approximately 10 to 15 minutes maximum uh, is a great way both for the presenter to maintain focus in their presentation and also for the viewer uh, and listener uh, uh, to you know maintain their attention span so we'll just say here 10 to 15 minutes in length and we'll change colors here just to show you how easy it is and number four and perhaps uh, most important is to really not be afraid to make mistakes. As you can already tell, I've made, I'm sure, several mistakes uh, along the way in this video alone. And uh, what I did before sitting down and hitting the record button was just to come up with a good idea, a brief outline of some of the key points that I wanted to cover during this video. Um, but otherwise, uh, having those points in mind, went ahead and pushed the record key and uh, am correcting myself uh, as I go along in this recorded video. I found that what I was doing initially was sitting down and really trying to plan uh, to an exacting level of detail what I was going to say and by doing that um, I kept delaying making this video um, while, whereas by taking the a simple approach of just making a few bullet points and sitting down and hitting the record key 
Um, here I am, uh, you know, in front of the computer, making this video and sharing it with all of you. Um, so, for point number four, we'll just say, um, don't be afraid um, to make mistakes. This entire setup here, uh, I've been experimenting for about an hour or so before sitting down to make this video. The bamboo tablet just recently arrived and I connected everything. This was very easy to set up. Um, as you can see, I've uh, been doing free text uh, from this point forward. But what I will do is clear my chalkboard, choose a different color, and we'll show you how easy it is to also make illustrations, um, to make graphs and charts. We can label the axes. Uh, using text. Graphs such as this or a figure may look familiar to many of you, but I find this to be very easy uh, holding the pen, using the tablet, using all of the software. And once I'm done, what I will do is end the recording, and Camtasia has a preset function to actually upload the video um, to. Uh, online hosting sites including YouTube and uh, within a few uh, moments this video will be uh, readily accessible to all of us online at YouTube. So that's about it for now. Uh, I hope you found this video to be somewhat helpful. If you have any comments, suggestions, feedback, criticisms, please feel free to uh, send them this way. I believe YouTube also has a comment function that we can use uh, to make comments. So um, any feedback that you have is welcome, and we will update this uh, video as needed. Um, but in the meantime, thank you very much for your attention, and uh, look forward to working with you.